guys and welcome to Kerbal Space Program's News Weekly. This week for the KSP team squad has been a difficult one, with the resumption of the spaceport and KSP forums, which also included the mass loss of data reverting back to April 2012. On a new developer update, Harvester posted that placing flags during EVA is being worked on for the next big update. These flags will be able to use to sign posts, historical landings and much more, so that the Space Center would be receiving a much needed upgrade involving organization that would have tabs for different types of vehicles and allow the filtering of debris, probes, bases and much more. In this week's first art spotlight, we have a very awesome looking Eve sunset using GIMP by Solar Liner. If you would like to check out more of his artwork and his upcoming videos, check the description for where you can find him. In this week's first craft spotlight, we have the, the amphibious VTOL SSTO by Level Lord, which can be used for interplanetary travel with the addition of his hyperspace ring. If you'd like to check out more of his crafts and download this ship, there will be a link in the description. That's all we have for today's Kill Space Program News Weekly. If you guys enjoyed this, be sure to hit that like button, and if you'd like to see more and be up to date with Kerbal Space Program News Spotlights, be sure to hit that subscribe button, and that's all guys, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.